How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are reacting to the official behind the scenes trailer for Space Marine 2. This is going to give us some new details on what's going on behind the scenes, as you can tell. Let's get to it. Hmm. Okay. This is a new shot. Of Space Marine 2 is a third person action shooter set in the grim, dark future of Warhammer 40,000. That puts you in the middle of a war against the tyrannies mm -hmm. for the control of an imperial solar system. Such a good choice for a villain, such a good choice. You're right in the thick of the action, and hopefully, people never have experienced that kind of aspect of, of the Warhammer world. I mean, we feel that it is the combination of all the things that we've worked so hard for so many years to do come to life. We wanted action in the sky, on the land. We wanted flames. We oh, wanted explosions. dude, that looks so good. It is a passion piece for all of the people working at Sabre. What are you doing? When I started working on the story, I spent months reading Black Library novels like No, No Fear to really get my head inside Ooh, okay. these, these characters, the, you know, to understand the Ultramarines and who they are. I might have to read them. I gotta read them. So the Space Marines were created for that great crusade. They were a necessary component in oh, a war Oh, what diorama is that in the back? And the Ultramarines are one of the most That's iconic really cool and famous of those Space Marine forces that have endured Ooh. through the 10,000 years from their creation at the Great Crusade to the stagnation of the 41st millennium. Gadriel, Charon. Most human oh, beings in this so world good, will dude. never see a space marine. Oh they're they're the stuff of legends. They're known as the angels of death. And so when one appears on the battlefield, it, it's like seeing an angel of God. His angels. <laughs> so Titus is a lieutenant <gasps> in our game. My pledge is eternal service. He's God, sort of a relic so of a, a time once past. You know, this guy is an unstoppable force. But you've also got to find some Ooh, kind of wait, grit I never... and oh, shit. A hardness that shows that he's know he seen, that, done that, seen more than all the other Ultramarines he's, he's now in this unit with. So we did the best we could in motion capture. But it is very different when you get to see these amazing graphics on the screen and what hundreds <laughs> and hundreds of people that work for Saber Interactive come up with and create. It's incredible. Lieutenant Titus, Ultramarine, Second Company. God, for me to go right so back to the bare basics of what acting is about and just be in an empty space. But on the day, it's about creating it and giving it a base of reality. Oh, so they use Lieutenant it. Titus! G36. Freeze the Omnisire! Shut it down. Now. It's your journey, you're the player. You're with what Titus is going and, on? and the Ultramarines. If you can't connect to their faces when the helmets are off, Wait. and you can't read those oh, we're gonna go back and look at that. there's something lacking. And that's, that's interesting, that's a story, dude. to bring these guys to life. I think as the player is gonna see a very, very different Titus. Okay. If we rupture the staging tanks, direct the flow into the valley, we can flood the area around the base. Right from the very beginning, we flood didn't just the, want to okay, create that's, that's for uh, any third person shooter. We wanted to create a game that embodied the galactic warfare that you, you come to know uh, from this, this franchise. Got it, I need a PC for this. I need a PC so bad. So the technology that drives Space Marine 2 is our own technology. So the team's gotten very, very good at creating signature moments in this game. And the okay. signature moment is the swarm. We Ooh. have a swarm technology that allows us Wait, to was have that a full kite? hundreds of these tyrannids. Did you guys just see that? Attacking the player. And we're also able to build a, a, a huge expanse where you have highly detailed characters. Oh, dude, that's like something that's fucking yelled in there. It looks so good. Distance. You can see that swarm coming at you. You can see the enemy waves coming at you. And you will get down God, and the multi melt looks away. crazy. You feel like you have you feel like you have an infinite universe in front of you. You know, you have sandbox games where you can wander around, but this goes one step further. It kind of almost feels like wherever you are in the action, wherever you look, there is another company of Marines down there fighting off swarms of Tyranids. And you've got okay. up there, we've got ships, you know, delivering and launching and drop ships landing. Okay. Everything's around you. One of the things people love about I think that's a this, screamer killer this, uh, too. I just saw that. It's the ability to customize your character. You know, you take these little miniatures, you pose oh, them man. the way you want, you give them the weapons that you want, you paint them the way you want. Those are painted well. And we wanted too. to take Those that same well. approach and put it in the game so you can do the same thing with your character. The game offers three modes 
a co-op story campaign that you can play with your friends, I'd, a highly replayable I need to get more friends, dude. mode with lots <laughs> so of progression and customization, and a PvP mode that puts you against other players. This looks so the good. The more you play these PvE missions, the deeper you can go into the progression of these characters, unlocking skills and okay. perks and weapons. Um, and as you do that, our, our famous AI director is able to increase the challenge, throw tougher enemies at you in more challenging Ooh. situations. As you've seen with some of our other titles, we have That's a interesting. track record of supporting our titles through quality of life updates, through paid DLC, and larger add-ons. DLC? So with Space Marine 2, Confirm. because the universe is so rich, and there's so much to draw, oh, that's so we're good. really excited about you know, what story we can tell and what oh, things so that we can continue to do in this game. The truth is that we've been kind of circling like sharks around Games Workshop for a long time, trying to get good. hold of this game. Good. We believe at Sabre that we have the, the story, the gunplay, the technology, the experience, and the passion to and deliver what fans want. So I'm scared, but I'm excited. Our team is, you know, they love working in this game. It's, it's one of their favorite games that they've ever worked on. Yep. So to see what 10 years of development on that Space Marine engine franchise story Ten is going to be years? like for Space Marine oh. 2, I think everybody involved oh, in the is really, really excited to see that. Uh, no matter what the fans are asking for, trust me, we're what asking fucking for What fucking was that? Was that a Black Templar? Oh my god! I might actually pre-order this just right now. Okay, hold up. Our team is... So, know. what I want to do is we're just going to look back at like two things, really. So... Are those Black Templar? No way. Hold on a minute. Oh no, those are Raven God. That's a... That's the... Yeah, that's Raven... Wait, so... Honestly, this is fucking incredible. I don't really know what to say anymore. Just guys, you don't have to pre-order it because I know everybody's fishing with the pre-order, but please get this game, support Saber Interactive, support Warmer 40,000 because this game is going to blow the fuck up and I want you guys to be a part of it. All right. So please hit that subscribe button. We're going to get a bunch of people together. Maybe get like some co-op missions together. It's going to be so much fun and just enjoy this game when it comes out. All right, boys. Catch y'all on the next one. Peace out.